you kiss me? Because I wanted to and you also wanted me to kiss you. I don't want you to kiss me, Smith. Why did you think that I want that? I... Why are you here? I came to tell you that I wish you well in your trip. So you came to tell me to leave? If I ask you to stay, it won't do either of us any good, Josephine. And you know it. Because I will never be able to love you like you want. You are right. I will leave, Smith. And you didn't have to come here. Okay. Well, I'll see you when we see you again. Yeah, I guess so. I'll miss you, Josephine. And thank you for everything you've done for me. It didn't even ask me to stay back. Good luck, Smith. Since you're leaving, can we have a goodbye kiss? Can we? Yes, yes. Hey, man. Why did you leave me here? Because I know you'll be fine. Lawrence. I know I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry, but you're going to be fine. The police have been coming to ask me questions. I hope you didn't tell them anything. No, I didn't. I just hope they believe me because the questions are too much for me. I'll reach out to my contacts. They will stop with the questions. Okay, then. Thank you, Brown. Thank you for saving me. The whole big. I know. I'll come check on you soon. Stay safe first. They'll be looking for you again. I know. Thank you. Lawrence, you should be in bed resting, not walking about. I'm fine. I just have to stretch my body, baby. I'm fine. I don't want anything to happen to you, Lawrence. And please, next time, don't try to play the hero. Please. Your husband is fine. He's in one piece. So he's serious about you not working? Yes, he is. And it's really annoying. You have to stand your ground on this. You can't quit working. How will you take care of yourself? He said he's going to place me on his salary. How much? He hasn't told me how much. But even with that, I don't want to be a housewife. Where is he now? He's ought to be home by now. He sent me a message. He'll be coming home late. He's out with John again. Mary, housewife, me. Don't agree to it. I know how hard you've worked to get to this point of your career. Just to throw it away like that because of a man. I don't want to throw away my career. I'm just confused. If I talk about it, he will ask me if my job is more important than him. Can you imagine? It's not about that. Make him see that you have worked hard to get here. I don't need to tell him. He knows this, Mary. He has been with me from the start to this point. He knows how hard I've worked. I miss you. I will miss you more, Smith. So what's the plan once you leave? I don't know yet. I'm seeing this like a vacation. A long vacation. Is this the vacation you've always wanted to go to? No, it's not the one. This one is one where I can clear head totally. I see. Yeah, I'll be fine at the end of it all, Smith. I know you'll be fine. I wish we can have this every day. I wish for this. We can't. I'm married. Being married doesn't mean we can't keep having a relationship. You deserve better than this, Josephine. You should be by a man's side who will marry you, not someone who will treat you less or make you question yourself. If you and I can sleep with each other, I'll be fine with it. I'll be the other lady outside. No, Josephine. Please, no. Okay, I'll be leaving soon. My flight is in the next three days. I'm heading home. Or do you need me to come and pick you up? No, Smith. I'm fine. I thank you for this gift. This is the best departing gift you could have ever given. Hey, man. How are you feeling? I'm good, on you? I'm fine. I'm sorry about what happened to you. Yeah, I'm also sorry as well about it all. I'm good. What happened exactly? What do you want to know? I am just curious, you know. The boss happened and I had to meet you. I had to step in like we always do. Lawrence. You heard him, John. Now you know what happened. Don't tell me you are still dealing. Can we not talk about this here, please? Damn it, Lawrence. Brown, I appreciate what you did for me. I've sent you some money to your account. Thank you, boss. Thank you. Why did John act that way? Forget about him. It's not him really. Focus on your health. Are you safe, cause? Yeah, I'm safe. I've dealt with the issue. Mom, it's so good to see you. You too, darling. Look at how beautiful you look. It's all thanks to my husband. He's taking care of me. I can see that. How's everything? Everything is fine, mom. Everything is okay. I'm happy to hear that. You have to also increase your prayers, mom. I'm always praying for you people. You should know me. Increase your prayers, mom. Do you know what happened two days back? What happened? My husband almost got killed. God forbid, God forbid. Mom, it was just God that helped him come home in one piece. God be praised. Nothing bad will happen to anyone of you. Amen. What happened? Mom, the story is long. Just be thanking God. 
So we will have to know how to do exactly. Baby, I don't know why, but I feel weak. Up to now? Yes, babe. You're not going to work today. You're going to be home. I'm meant to have resumed work already. Your body keeps rejecting work. After all, I told you it's a housewife you'll be. I'm not going to be a housewife, Smith. Let's leave that conversation till later. How will I be a housewife with all of my skills? God forbid. I won't say anything. So how do you want to do now? Should I take you to the hospital? I don't feel like... Have you done the pregnancy test? No, I haven't. Go and do it. Head to the bedroom and do it now, Karen. Smith, I'm not pregnant. Go and do it now or I'll take you to the hospital. Choose one. Why is she sending me a message that she's leaving? Why can't she? Tell me some good news. I'm pregnant. We're expecting a baby. What? Yes, baby. We're expecting a baby. I will miss Eva. I don't have anything to say to you. You are hungry, I know. But this is for your short ride. You don't have to go, Josephine. I have to go to clear my head. Josephine, why don't you support this my decision? Even if I don't support you, you are leaving so. I will be back soon. Your soon can be the next 30 years. I promise you, it will be different this time around. You promise me? Yeah, I might even come up with a man. <laughs> I just believe that. False hopes. I will try to fall in love. I will do this. I will miss you, Josephine. That's what happened, Mom. Wow, you said to stop going out in the night. Who is going out in the night? Hello, sister. Good morning. Angel, I didn't know you were around. How are you? I'm fine, and Lawrence is fine as well. I didn't ask of him, but that's good to hear. So who's going out in the night? I'm not going to the hospital. Who's in the hospital? My sister's lover, Brown. Brown? That? Yes, that's my man. What do you want to say about it? Nothing. I I'm happy you have someone who makes you happy. Thank you. I'll be heading out so you all can continue to have your conversation. Say hello to him for me, Bianca. Okay. Take care of yourself, Angel. She's dating Brown, the security guy. Yes, that's who your sister is dating. Can you imagine that? Oh my god. How can she be with that man? He's way below class. Your sister is your sister. Thank god she even wants the security guy. It's funny, mom. I've left her to do whatever she likes. Anything she wants to do. Let her do it in jail. Lawrence, what's the meaning of all that? Meaning of all what? He was short, Lawrence. He was short. I know he was shot. All thanks to you, you're still in the game. I never left, man. You told me that you left, that everything is clean and legit. Does anything look like it's not clean? What are you doing, Lawrence? What are you doing? What we always do. I've left that lie behind me, Lawrence. I'm done with all of that. Did I force you to do anything? It's only a matter of time. John, they don't even want to see you around. If they see you, they want you dead for snitching on us. Can't have this conversation. They don't have it. Forget it all. I'm heading to the office now. I will see you when you come. Okay. Welcome home. Thank you, Bianca. Where are you coming from, Eva? Josephine just left town now. She has left the country. What? She has left? Yes, yeah, she has left the country, Bianca. Wow. Why? I thought she is here to stay, Eva. She has changed her mind and left the country. She will be back soon. Wow. Is everything okay at home? How is Brown's body? He's feeling fine. He's okay getting better. That is good to hear. Yeah, but I think something isn't right. I've been thinking on everything. Thinking on what exactly? I've been thinking on how Brown got the injury and the story isn't just okay. Bianca, think on your investigations and all, but I'm not interested in it. It has got something to do with Lawrence. Lawrence? I don't know. I'm just guessing. Don't you ever get tired. Always today and tomorrow. See, I'm prayed upon hearing all this and begin to think you are obsessed and jealous of him. I'm not. You sound like you are Bianca, believe me, and it's exhausting for me. Can we not have a day when you don't care about him or talk about him? Baby. I'm your baby forever, baby. Karen, I don't want you to stress yourself henceforth. I'm not going to be a housewife, Smith. This isn't up for argument. I don't want you working. Your focus should be on your health and my babies. Sweet. I will have a nanny in the house for you. I don't need a nanny in the house. I'm strong enough to do all the chores. Baby, I don't want you to stress in any way. I'm not going to be stressed. I want to work and do everything. 
by myself, baby. Not going to happen. What do you want me to cook for you? Do you want to cook for me? Yes, I want to cook for you. Look at my bestie. I'm so happy to see you, Angel. Look at how beautiful you're looking. Thank you. You're also looking very good, my friend. Thank you. How is marriage life? Marriage life is going very well. It's fine. I can see it on you. You're looking good. I've missed you so much. Me too. When are you returning back to school? Maybe next week. I'm leaving school, Angel. What? You're leaving school? I'm leaving school. I'm leaving the country as well. Leaving the country to where? I met someone and we've been dating each other and he wants me to live with him. Wow, who's he? You don't know him. It's not long I met him. And you want to follow him out of the country like that? I'm sure you don't know him so well, Amara, or do you? It doesn't matter. He's a great guy and I have an opportunity here I won't miss. Hey, baby. My love, I was just thinking about you now and asking myself if you deserted me. I can't leave you brown. How are you feeling? I've been better, but I'll survive. My body still aches me badly. So sorry about that, babe. You'll be fine in a matter of time. Yeah, I will, baby. Why didn't you tell me you were shot? Why did you tell me it was an accident? I didn't want you worried, that's why. I know how you can be worried and didn't want that. But don't worry, I'll be alright. You scared me, Brown. You will have to stop the security work soon. Hmm. <sighs> I don't want to worry you, Bianca. That's why. And I know these are the risks that comes with my job. I'm sorry. You should have told me. We are a team, remember? I know, Bianca. I should have told you. I'm sorry. Just promise me you'll be more open with me in the future. No more lies or covering up stuff. I can't stand the thought of you getting hurt. I promise, Bianca. No more keeping secrets. I'm lucky to have you by my side. Well, you better remember that. Now let's focus on your recovery. The doctor says you'll be out of here soon. I appreciate you being here, Bianca. Your presence makes everything better. Where is Angel? She ought to be home by now. Where did she go to? Angel, where the hell have you been? Look at the time. Lawrence, I'm sorry. I and my mom were just and I lost track of time. Lost track of time? This is unacceptable, Angel. I've been waiting here worried sick and you couldn't call. I know, baby. I didn't mean to stay out so late. I am sorry. I was with mom. So because you went out to see your mom, you think you can just come back home whenever you feel like it? What if something had happened to you? I am sorry. Stop telling me sorry. I was calling you and you didn't pick the call. Do you think it's safe out there for you? Have you forgotten you are now my wife? Can we talk about this calmly? Calmly? You've been keeping me waiting, not answering your phone. What am I supposed to think? And you want us to talk calmly about this? I said I'm sorry, Lawrence. Yelling at me won't change anything. You are right, Angel. You know what? From now on, I don't want you going out. You'll be staying at home all day long. Lawrence. I don't want to hear anything you have to say. Just go inside the room. You're not going to see anyone henceforth. No more. I'm sorry. Angel, to the room. Go and stay there. Rubbish. She doesn't know what's happening out there. Look at the time she's coming home. Why is he so angry with me? And how did I not even see his calls to pick up? Look at the way he talked to me angrily. He's really pissed off at me. I will have to apologize to him. Hello, mom. Are you at home already? Yes, mom. I'm at home. Thank God. Hope you are fine. I'm okay, mom. Why is your voice now sounding like this? A bit dull. I'm fine, mom. I'm just tired from driving all the way here. You try Lawrence to get you a driver. Okay, mom, I've heard. Is he at home? Let me say hello to him. No, mom. I mean, yes, mom. He's in the restroom. He just got back not long. This why I keep in late nights. It's not good. It's only today, mom, and it's because of you. Me or your friend? When you two were talking and lost track of time, well, say hello to your husband for me. I will, mom. Thank you and good night. Good night, Angel. Okay, mom. Is everything okay? Don't sound too far. What happened? Is your husband angry you got some late? Yes, mommy. He's angry. I'm paying all the bills. I can tell that something is going on, man. I'm going to be a father. Oh my god. Congratulations, Smith. Thank you, John. Thank you. Wow. I'm going to be a godfather. I found out this morning and you know I've been suspecting that my baby is coming soon. Like I 
could sense it within my spirit. I'm so happy for you, man. Congratulations. Thank you, John. So all views on me, John. Bring it on on me. How about so many of you as well? You want to go home with a woman? I'm just teasing you. I'm really happy. You shouldn't be here but home. Let me finish my glass first. No, no. You should go home to your wife. I know she's the only one at home now. Or am I lying? You should be with her. I'll go to her soon. I'm even thinking of bringing in a nanny for her. Sounds like a good idea. That's if she agrees to it. Because I know women are protective of their husband a lot and won't bring in anyone to be with them at all. Why? Cheating nature of men to avoid stories that touch. Hey man, what are you doing here this late, Lawrence? I was in the area, so I decided to stop by. Another operation happened. We had to take care of those who did this to us. How did it go? It was really messy, but we won. And now we are going to have a sit down to discuss about everything. I don't think you should go. No one can be trusted these times. I know that, but I've got to attend to make sure everything is settled. They tried to kill you. Hello Bianca, it's been a while we last saw. How are you doing? What are you doing here? Checking up on a friend. What kind of man would I be if I don't check up on those close to me? I won't be surprised if you don't do it. She always sees me as a bad person, but she's the bad one here. I'll be outside, Brown. That's not necessary. I was already leaving. My love. Where have you been, Smith? I'm so sorry. I know that I'm late. I'm sorry, babe. Look at the time you're coming home. Is this how you want to be? I'm sorry. Is this where you want me to be a housewife? Come on, baby. See, I was outside with John and we were celebrating. Celebrating what? Celebrating my unborn child. You told him already? Yes, I did. He's my best friend and brother. You should know this. Okay. You don't like the fact that I told him? I don't like the fact that you came home late. Why would you leave me all alone here, to him all day? Mary didn't come around. So it's because Mary came around, you came late. It won't happen again, I promise you. I'm sorry, okay? Where's Lawrence? Where is he? Where is he now? Or has he gone out? The door is locked. Did he lock me at home and go out? Where are you coming from? What kind of question is that? It's a normal question. Same way you were mad that I got home late. You should be thinking of giving me an apology. I already apologized, but you didn't want to accept my apologies. Whatever. Lawrence. What is it, Angel? Do you think I'm in the mood for all this? Why are you so pissed off? What happened? Nothing happened. Everything is fine. I saw your mom's missed call while on my way home. Why is she calling? Pick it and find out. Hello, ma. How are you feeling? I'm fine. What did he want here, Brown? He just came back to check on me, see how I'm doing. At this late hour, why didn't he come early? I don't know, babe, but all I know is he came to check on me. Does he have something to do with your accident? Why would you think so? Forgive me, I'm just asking. Let's not meet today about Lawrence, please, I beg of you. You're right, I'm sorry. Yeah, so did you get what you went to search for? Yes, I did. Hey, baby girl. Josephine, how are you doing? I'm fine and you, babe. I'm good. I just arrived at my destination. That is good to hear. I miss you so much already. Me too. I miss you. Remember our deal? We are going to have a man before I back home. Yeah, I remember. And you are also coming home with a man. Yes, yes. I remember everything. So how is everything over there? Everything is good. Going well. Met with my old friends. That's good to know. Hope you have not called him. Called who? Your crush. The one who chased you out of the country. <laughs> I've not called him. And I don't have any plans on calling him. I will say you said so. I know it's late already. Let me allow you to sleep. Take care of yourself. You too, Josephine. Bye. Whoever we like, I could go on and on.